Greetings, everybody. This is Armory speaking. For those who know me, I'm not a, a flat earther. Rather, I say the, the earth is much, much, much larger than they say it is. And outside the, as we say, the ice ring, there's more water, there's more continents, another ice ring, more water, more continents, another ice ring. So the earth is really just much bigger than they say it is. So there's not the curvature they speak of when they talk about eight, in, eight inches per mile squared. That formula doesn't jive. So anyway, let's uh, take a peek here at um, the Apollo experience. Apollo 17. This is season one, episode one, part one. We're going to start at about 11 minutes. This is the, uh, the last time we went to the moon. So check it out real quick here. So, um, anyway, it takes off, and now we are uh, 150 miles above the Earth. So we're 150 miles above the Earth, and this is a uh, camera looking out. And well, let's uh, watch what's about to happen here. 213,000 nautical miles away. Oh, uh, what's that? Um, see, the Earth is coming into view. And that looks pretty dang straight to me. Yeah, it looks pretty straight to me. Looks like uh, they give us a quick glimpse of perhaps the true Earth in this quick clip. That looks pretty dang straight great to me <laughs> and but the only reason is because the earth is a lot bigger than they say it is you're only seeing one little snippet itty bitty teeny lighted this is just a even though it's 150 miles up it this is a, because this is a very small opening remember this is the the last stage of the uh saturn v you know five rocket so this is a very small aperture it's like looking through a telescope really so you're basically looking at a telescope at just one little piece of the Earth. So you just get seeing a sliver of the Earth, but still you're 150 miles up. So, I don't know. I just thought I'd share this with you folks. I find this very, very, very fascinating. And then a second later, it cuts to black. So, here it is one more time. To climb ever more rapidly. Oh, wait, let's go back a little bit. I'm sorry. This is targeted to uh, last five minutes, 51 seconds, accelerating Apollo 17 to the uh, required speed to get it into an orbit that'll intercept the moon. I don't care if they say we went to the moon or not. We definitely went 150 Houston, miles up. Good and the thrust is go. Boom. Booster report the thrust looks good on the S4B. The velocity increasing. Uh, up now to 26,000 feet per second. Beginning to climb ever more rapidly. This burn was initiated at an altitude of about 97 nautical miles above Earth. Uh, when finished, the spacecraft will be at about 150 miles above Earth. And on its way to the moon. Some... 213,000 nautical miles away. Well, 
Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Uh, that's um, some really fascinating footage I just thought I'd share with you folks. And uh, until next time, everybody. Hope you're all doing well out there. God bless. Peace. And be well.